Hey guys, how's it going? This is a freaking crazy time to be alive right now. The coronavirus is going crazy. In the UK, we basically just got on lockdown. So there's like strict rules now. You've got to stay in your house. You can't go outside with more than one other person. Things like that. A um, bunch of rules have come into place. I know this is the case for a lot of other countries as well. But we've, we're pretty late to the party, actually. We've only just sort of like, you know, started to take it seriously, really. But yeah, it's pretty crazy. So you're probably all at home. And that's great because I'm going to play some Rust today. Hopefully, I can entertain you guys. So let's get into it. Going solo. Okay, straight away. There's a massive twig base right here. What is this monstrosity? Okay, <laughs> what is this? Why have you done this? Whoever's built this, why? What is the purpose of this? Massive twig base. It's some kind of fishing thing. Whatever. Right then, here's the goal. I am going to build a shop. Loads of people need stuff. And I can craft a load of stuff now, this wipe that I've researched. We're going to build a shop. And we're going to sell loads of stuff. And I'm going to do a raid as well. So... Two of my goals. There's a massive clan over there. How you doing, lad? Freaking hell. All the furnaces are on. Very active. Probably shouldn't live close to those guys. We'll find a place to live right now. But looking good. I like this map. There's loads of shops already, which is cool. Give me some competition. Where shall we live? That is the question. The outpost, the water treatment plant, and the junkyard are all next to each other. That'll be a pretty good part to live in, I think. So we could go live over there. This little piggy stuck. Cannot move. Waiting for my spear, mate. And then you're going down. Say hello to my spear. Boom. That still didn't kill it. It's got two spe The spears are disappearing. I can't pick them up. Oh. I will not want to mess with this guy. Hey, up. Oh. Aha. Get wrecked. There he goes, dead. And he's dropped down there. That's just a uh, classic right there. Try not to die from fall damage. Uh. And I died from fall damage. It's all right. I spawned quite close to my body. Quickly loot the lighthouse on the way back anyway. I'm back at my body. I just noticed the large helicopter fly into that clan compound over there. So, yeah, as you can see, they're very much active. I'm not going to build too close to them. But I am going to live around here because all the shops in this area have been raided. Uh, probably by that clan. So, basically, there needs to be a new guy selling stuff. But that's going to be me. All right, there is one shop over there. He's selling stone. All right, freaking stone. Okay, but I'm going to build my base around this lake. It looks pretty good. We'll go check it out in a minute when it gets to morning time. There's the lake. Fire there. I'm not going to go for him simply because I've got um, quite a bit of loot on my body and I just don't think that the risk is worth it fighting a guy when I've got my base basically in my inventory. So we'll leave him alone for now. found this base that has a free TC. So instead of building my own base, I'm going to take over this, guys. It's quite close to the lake. Not too close, though. So that's fine. This is where we're going to live. I'm happy with this. What the hell's going on here? Stop. <laughs> Kill one. Oh, I've killed all three of them. How are you doing, guys? You good? They're going to come out from the base. They all had basic tools. Okay, I've got no idea what these guys are, are about, but... <laughs> Okay, um, what I'm basically looking for now is an animal so I can get a furnace down and put a sheet metal door on my base quick time. Okay, I know where those guys live. They don't live too close to me, but there's a few of them. So they might progress more. They might end up having... Uh, uh, if, if all three of them had bows, I would have been a dead man. But only one of them had a bow, so it's fine. Oh, here's a cave. Grab some low grade from in here, probably. Okay, I can confirm that there's nobody living in this cave. Home sweet home. This is only a temporary base. I just want to let you guys know. I'm not going to live here forever. Somebody's doing a rocket raid right next to me. GG. Who's getting raided, I wonder? Ah, uh, bo uh, boat base down there. We've got one guy, like, guarding the outside there. they got another guy on the other side. And they got another guy on top of the base. Okay, these are the guys from the clan base that we saw at the very start um, of the video today. Boom, another explosion gone off. Player, hello. Oh, my God. Player in this little twig base. Some keys. 
Thank you. They're still going at it. Rocket Skullor. Ah, hot air balloons. Go on, lads. Don't shoot at me. Oh, crap. People are online around here. Oh, no. I'm scared. These guys with hazmat suits around me. Oh, no, no, no. Almost made a play, man. Not to worry, lads. Okay, I'm not going back there because they that uh, they definitely would have looted everything by now. That's quite hectic. All right, I've got enough for a furnace now with the low grade I've got from this cave. So scrap going on the seas. But now let's get our furnace down quick time before we get flame raided. Oh, shotgun trap. Everything happened for a reason on this game. I'm going to have that for my shop. Oh, I hear a player farming. Hold on. Kill one. Fuck you, fucking bitch. <laughs> These are the guys that I killed just before. The weird ones. Boom, back at base. Okay, I'm just gonna wait for it to get to morning. There's no point trying to fight people when it's night and you can't see anything. Killed one of them though. They seem to be farming around my area. So hopefully I'll pick up some more kills from these guys today and get some free farm. But they live over there, so shouldn't cause us too much of a problem. Fingers crossed. Boom, morning time. You know what? I just had some thinking. Maybe that could be our freaking goal after we've built the shop to raid these guys. Okay, sounds like a plan. Furnas is down. Quickly whack that on before those AK shots get closer to my base. Thank you. <laughs> I use my only phone call to contact my daddy. I got 20 long years for some dust in a baggie. Let's play a farming. I'm gonna have to try and kill him. I just have to. All trick base. I'm gonna try and kill this guy. Woo! Got you, bro. <laughs> okay. Well, he can't be living. Sorry, I can't be having people live this close to me, mate. Take it easy. Have a great day. All right. I'm going to put a lock on this guy's TC. I know I'm being a bit of a dick, but he's living right next to me, this dude. Can't have it. He locks almost crafted. Wait, is my internet? My internet's gone off. No. Hello? Internet? No, my internet has just disconnected. Oh my God, that is karma on another level. My internet's completely gone off. <laughs> no way. It's because of this coronavirus. Everyone's at home using the internet. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Oh, my days. Okay, two sex. Absolute karma. That naked's going to come back. God damn you, internet. Oh, the internet's back. Yes, come on. Get in. All right, let's see if this guy's come back online. I got killed by the guy that was building the base. Oh, my God. I swear to... Right, I'm making it my freaking mission to get rid of this guy. You do not deserve to have survived that, my friend. Not in a million freaking years. I am not having that at all. He's farming. Oh, he hit me once. Him again. I've still got building crib. Yes, I do. Where's his body? Right there. All right, boom. I've briefed him. And I can't just. Oh, I can demolish that. Oh, wait. Never mind. Perfect. <laughs> Clearing authorization, authorizing, putting a lockdown. Anything in the TC? A little bit of loot. All right, I'm a, I, I know I'm a bit of a dick here, but this is what you got to do, man, on Rust. You got to get rid of your neighbors. You, you have a choice. You can either ally with the guy that builds right next to you or get rid of him before he gets a chance to build next to you. And I've decided to get rid of him. All right, I'm sorry, but there you go. My internet might go, my internet might go down again. 
All right, and he might take over the freaking area, which I do not want. Woo! Guys, I'm friendly sometimes. Sometimes I'm not. I looked on Twitter, and uh, there's some people complaining that their internet's going to be down for two weeks. Bro, if my internet went down for two weeks, I would lose my shit. Oh, bella ciao, bella ciao. Okay, I'm going to heal up the seas, guys, and get some uh, components and scrap, and hopefully get the gears we can uh, we need to, for the shop. Player. Is he a fresh spawn? Hello. How are you? I think he's new to the game. Uh, press V to talk, mate. Hold down your V button. <laughs> he's... Hello. You, you can use your mouth to you can use your mouse to move around. You do realize? No. Okay. Au revoir. Good luck to you. Yes. Just got a CCTV camera. That'll be going outside the shop. Sounds like we've got two players farming. We're going to have to do something about that, lads. Hit him once, killed him. I want to kill his mate with the hazmat, though. Oh, how low on HP am I? Holy crap. How low on HP? I came out of my base so low on HP, then what are you doing, Jordan? That's probably the way they live down there. That twig base. They still got twig on there. See if we can go deep here. Okay, these guys are new. I'm not going to say anything. I'm just going to let them continue building the base, I think. If these guys are not as close to me. I'm going to be nice. I'm going to take the hazmat suit because that's pretty good and all the loot I got from them. But uh, I'm not going to get through the TC and screw his eyes over. They've got backwards facing walls, but they're probably not. They're probably quite new at the game, these ones. So we're going to leave them be. Um, I'm not going to speak, though. I'm going to write this guy a note. Hey. Hello, how are you doing? How are you doing? Hello. I left do. him a note. How are you? <laughs> I'm no friendly. Problem. I will not kill you. Here's the tools. Okay. Um, that's nice after killing me and my friend. <laughs> uh, well, anyways, uh, why is the house all dark? Oh, it's night outside. Okay. Uh, um, anyways, uh, how are you? I'm going. Oh, Woo! got with a bow. Hit him once. Okay, I'm going to get out of here. I'm going to let those guys be there. I'm going to take this back to base now. Deposit this loot. Quite a decent amount. It's going to help me out a little bit. The hazmat suit's always nice for 1v1s. I'm going to go back out on the sea now and try and get more gears so we can make the shop. So today I am playing more of a survivalist kind of play style. Um, as you can see, I'm not using my mic to communicate. I'm not interacting with players in that sense. I'm literally just playing a solo kind of play style today where I just don't really want to I don't really want to make I don't really want to be talking to people or anything like that I just want to keep myself to myself have my own little base build a shop and you know kill players and occasionally let you know and occasionally be nice I'm not making any like proper alliances or anything of that nature it's just a different type of play style I'm going for today and I'd just rather be like this you know, sometimes I switch up. Sometimes I ally with players and then play it, end up playing with them for half the video. But today, I want to keep it solo and I just want to keep it like this. So I am going to be a dick, okay? It's going to happen. I'm going to kill people. Um, it's part of Rust, okay? See, we might have a problem with these guys. He's out of arrows. I'll help him out. Hey, I killed the bear for you, mate. It's all yours. Yes, two gears. Right, I'm going to quickly do some base upgrading on this base. And also get that level one workbench down. Player farming. And you know what? It's going to be with that guy from that base. I'm telling you right now, I'm going to have to kill these people. Woo! Got bro.
<laughs> Get wrecked. I love shotgun traps. He got himself stuck down there. Look at that. I'll take the loot, mate. Why'd you jump down here? <laughs> Seriously. All right, we've got the basic base under control. I'll be adding the roof and whatnot. And, in a so and soon I'll be adding the shop. I've decided I'm just going to attach the shop onto this base we've already got. Because honestly, this is not a bad place to have a shop, to be fair. As I said, the two shops over there have been raided, so they're out of action. Um, and there's not really any, many other shops around this whole area, except for this guy over here who's not really selling much at all. So, uh, yeah, I'll be selling the basic stuff for all the fresh spawns that spawn around here. Garage door, revolver, things of that nature. And, yeah, we should be making some profit, hopefully. We'll be ready. All right, I need three gears. I did just spend some of my gears, so I'm not going to lie, on garage doors. Just because there's been people stalking my base today, and I'm, ruined, uh, I'm worried that I was going to get raided. So I spent, it on, I spent it on base safety, safety first. But this is what the base looks like and literally I'm gonna go and get the remaining gears now and then we will be able to craft the shop Hells to the yells. Oh my god. It's got twig on it You are joking dude. This is the second time today that somebody's left that as twig. Are you freaking kidding me? See this is what I mean Let's see if we can get in Yes, okay, there's a boat inside here and there's a TC that's unlocked. No way. Okay, let's see what's in there. There probably isn't much. Boom. Just wood. Nothing else. Uh, what about in here? Anything in here? Nope. Any low grade inside the engine? Yes, 42. All right, sweet. <laughs> okay, let's grab this and hopefully we'll find gears now. Come on, give me gears, man. Game. What is wrong with you today? Okay, I didn't get the gears. I got loads of other stuff. Not the gears, though. So hey, I'm just going to quickly do a depot and then head back out. I wouldn't want to die right now with 233 scrap and a bunch of other loot. Home sweet home. Nicely done. I'm being chased. died as you guys saw oh flamethrower thanks that's cool what i really need is the gears give me the gears please game please i should go back to base with this flamey but i in fact i'm gonna take the flamey back to base to repair it it's a few wooden bases i could raid actually right near me so but yeah but i need the gears though that is my i'm straying off track here because i'm not getting what i need oh he's a player i'm gonna try and flame him to death You. <laughs> My friend, why you kill me? Thanks for the wood, mate. On sweet home. I'm gonna flame raid this base, guys. But I need the gears first. I wanna get my shop down. Boom! Yes! Oh! Rust gods! What about this? Okay, I can't get that lucky, but two gears. Only need one more now. Get that back to base without dying, please. Finally, we're making it. We're making progress. I want to get this done. And then I want to flame raid my closest neighbor who happens to have a wooden base right here. See what he's got. And there's fresh corn outside his base, so it's a new guy. Let's do it. Flame raid time. We only need one more gear, boys. Way to end it today. Let's go. Okay, I'm almost ready to go and do the raid. I'm just going to heal up, and then we'll go. Hopefully, we get gears. That would be amazing. Let's go through this side. Let's do it. Go back to base and get more low grade. How much health is this on? Yeah, I will. I'm gonna quickly go back now. Okay, back at base. Grab the low grade we need. I think I'm out of low grade. No way. And I'm out of cloth as well. Just quickly go past the abandoned cabins and see if the boxes have respawned. Maybe I'll get a gear from there. Handbag barricade. <laughs> Post is clear. Just quickly recycle. That's it. Boom. Tap. Anything? Any boxes here? Doesn't look like it. 200 cloth that'll do me let's get out of here what are you giving us gears oh my god the gods the freaking rust gods we've got enough to craft the vending machine okay home sweet home oh it 
It's going to be close, this. Super close. We're in. Tool cupboard's got a lock on it, though. Bloody hell. All right, not bad. That's low grade. And loads of animal fat. Oh, yes. Yes! We're getting that back to base. What? From a wooden base? Are you kidding me? One, two, three, four, five, one, two, almost a thousand sulfur and four thousand metal ore from a wooden base. I'm not complaining about that. Let's get that back. Decent raid right there. Not bad for a flame raid. Not bad at all. Okay, let's go get through the TC. Oh, just a little bit of wood in the TC. That was all. 300 wood. <laughs> Still, I'm happy with that. But now it's the moment we've all been waiting for the whole video. I can finally make the shop and put it down. So I'm going to get that done right now. Okay, vending machine's being crafted. Unfortunately, I don't have any vending machine uh, skins on this account. I have several Steam accounts. My main Steam account has all the, Steam, uh, the, the skins on it. The reason I have multiple Steam accounts is so that people, um, it's harder to find me because I used to have people that would um, hack and things like that to find out where I was on the map. It got really annoying, so I had to make a few other Steam accounts, but you know, it comes with being a YouTuber, unfortunately. I don't have any skins on this one, which sucks. Boom! There we go. Hell yes. Nicely done. The shop is down, boys. Oh. All right, so the plan is I'm going to add lots of basic stuff, garage doors, pistols, stuff like that. But I'm also going to be adding electrical stuff because I can actually craft a lot of the electricity stuff because I researched it last wipe. So I'll be selling the electrical branch, which is very uh, important. I'll be selling the RF broadcaster. I'll be selling the solar panel. So yeah, and hopefully more electrical stuff because I've actually got a few things in my base as well. So I'll be selling loads of that stuff to help people build uh, electric bases and get the CCTV cameras down and stuff like that. And in the next video, we're going to basically turn this base into an electrical base as well. We're going to add a CCTV camera outside, and we're going to add loads of electricity as well. So, yeah, stay tuned for that, guys. I think on that note, I'm going to end the video here. Thanks a lot for watching. I'm going to try my best to start uploading daily, because even though I've said this a lot, I want to get my channel back up to where it used to be, because at the moment... I've not been, I've been slacking, you know, there's no other way of saying it. I want to be bringing out more content to you guys, trying to get us, trying to get daily uploads, trying to upload as much as I can, because, um, yeah, if I basically just put everything I've got into YouTube right now, which I can do because everybody's staying at home anyway, then I can do this. I can get loads of videos out, and that is what my goal is at the moment, because, yeah, nothing makes me happier than uploading videos to you guys, honestly. Just upload a video and seeing your comments, it's the best feeling ever, especially when it's a good video that you guys enjoy. Um, so, yeah, thanks a lot for watching and stay tuned for the next video, which will hopefully come out tomorrow. Thanks a lot, guys. See you soon.